be stopped and there needs to be a change. We can't just keep on saying that it will happen sometime, but we want to end gun violence. They may be small, but these girls have a big message. Three impressive young students taking it upon themselves to rally a march in protest of Congress. They'll join the national movement next Wednesday in response to the Parkland, Florida school shooting. It is our top story tonight. Action News reporter Brian Abel talked to the students behind the walkout. Brian. Yeah, Ellen, what? A mass school walkout by middle schoolers who protest Congress's inaction to do more than tweet thoughts and prayers after school shootings. We need action. This is a flyer for the walkout here at Nora Line with the national movement and the three young ladies you are about to meet took the call for action seriously. Annabelle Bean, Abby Gombieski, and Mia Eklund, three impressive young ladies who are inspiring their fellow students at Nora to join others across the country, staging a 17-minute walkout. One minute for each of the 17 students and staff killed during the Valentine's Day shooting at Marjorie Douglas High School in Parkland, Florida. They know not everyone in the school will join, and they don't claim to have the solutions, but they hope this march will empower those tasked with creating laws, Congress, to find a way to keep them safe. We know that this um, walkout will not change everything and will not stop gun violence like flat out. But I think that it's important that we get a lot of people on board, we get a lot of people thinking, and then that will m possibly solve solutions, I mean actually have solutions in the near future to actually end gun violence. And I talked briefly with the principal tonight who says they are adjusting to the march and any student that does want to join, they will not face any consequences. Reporting live in Oak Park, Brian Abel, 7 Action News. All right, Brian, thank you. And